Let him hang a bit first. Let him await my pleasure. <sighs> but the wizard alone is barely a meal for one such as myself. Now, boy, boy is a face. on the ground. Are you well? Oh, what a thoroughly unpleasant experience. I shall have more pity for flies in the future. Can you tell us what happened? Sinathra snatched me. Took me unawares, I'm afraid. I really didn't expect to encounter anything of her sort in this corner of the wood. No, not at all. You see, I came here to get away from trouble. Darkness is spreading across Mirkwood. A, a, a darker than usual darkness, I mean. And it's coming from Dol Guldur in the south. Roscobel, my usual home, lies a little too close to Dol Guldur for comfort. So I came here. I have several such retreats. You can never be too prepared, living in Mirkwood and all. But do I know you? No, Radagast. But you do know me. Ah, young Bellarum. It's a pleasure to see you. So you are a part of this little party, too? <laughs> it's quite a mixed bag, really. I don't see elves, dwarves, and men rubbing elbows often, especially not in Mirkwood. <laughs> now add an eagle as well. This is turning out to be a rather extraordinary day, really, all things considered. I am just glad we came in time. My friends and I have a mission. And we came seeking your aid. We're looking for the dragon Urgost, who lives in the Grey Mountains. And we have no time for a lengthy search. We were told you might be able to help us find him. You wish to find a dragon? Oh dear, is that really wise? <laughs> the 
The spider's venom can be deadly. We should attend to you at once. No cause for concern. It happens I know a thing or two about venoms and poisons. Sinathra's poison could be deadly, but killing prey outright is not the way of such creatures. No, they much prefer to keep their meals alive for a time. <laughs> Just as a farmer might age a cheese to improve its flavor, really. She used only enough venom to keep me quiet. Our mission is urgent. Do you know where Urgos can be found? Well, he, he's a dragon, so I would say the Grey Mountains. I... yes, that is as we have already said. But do you know where in the Grey Mountains? I haven't the foggiest notion, really. What? So we've just been chasing the wind? Ah, now, not so fast. I may not know where Urgos dwells, but I just might be able to find out. But I would need my staff for that, and I, I seem to have mislaid it somewhere. We found your staff. Here it is. I knew you would have need of it once we found you. Ah, oh, excellent. Aren't you the clever one? <laughs> Crafty as a fox in your own fashion, too, I can tell. I'm grateful to you. Well then, let's see what we can find out, shall we? My friends might know a thing or two. news for me, little one? Ah. I see, yes. Oh, yes, indeed. Very brave of you. Well done, my friend. And there you have it. Uh, perhaps you could explain further for those of us who do not speak the language of swallows. Oh, you don't? Quite a pity, really. They're rather pleasant little fellows. Always something nice to say. Well, what did this one have to say? Quite a bit, actually. Here, let me show you. Have you considered my offer? I will have your price soon enough. Think carefully before you spurn this offer, dragon. As mighty as you are, you would do well not to offend my master. I did not say I refused. Only that you must first achieve my reward before you can give it. Ah, formality. I go now to take your price, but I will leave men behind to await your answer. Consider well, but not too long. My time and my thoughts are my own to spend. For now.
still here? I thought you were off to find a dragon. These woods are still thick with enemies. Are you certain you can find your way to safety? <laughs> Don't concern yourself with that. I've lived in Mirkwood for a very long... These woods are still... Ah, oh, the enemy never needs a reason to kill. Farewell, Radagast. It's good to see. We're in search of a dragon called Urgost. Do you know anything about him? A dragon? What madness drives you to the lair of such a deadly creature? Agendaur seeks an alliance with him. We must make sure that never happens. How the three of you could hope to kill a dragon is beyond me. I know of only one person who bandied words with a dragon and lived to tell of it. And that would be Bilbo. I reckon we found more of Durin's folk dwelling in the Grey Mountains. What? They have a hidden refuge called Nordenbad. By my beard. When all this trouble is finished, you must show me the way there. I would meet these distant kinsmen and welcome them to trade with Erebor. From what I have seen, I'm certain they would welcome the opportunity to become reacquainted with their kin. But there is still much to do before that day comes. Farewell, Glowin. Imladris is a pleasant haven, yet I prefer the high peaks of the mountains. The three of us would have died in Gundabad without the help of the eagles. Thank you, Hamanel. You see now the wisdom of Gwahir. He must have foreseen such a need. Your thanks are welcome. But it was worth the danger to see the pits of Gundabad torn asunder. Imladris is a pleb. There is more I must do here. It is kind of you to seek me out again, Eridan. My father is deeply concerned over the tidings you bring. While my thoughts stray often to those who travel south, my most immediate danger comes from the north. You fear that Sauron would attack Rivendell directly? He will not leave his fortress of Baradur, but he will send his servants against us. The Ringwraiths are the greatest of these, but his will moves also through living men. Is there any news of Frodo? Is it not strange that the fate of the world should rest upon one who is so small? And yet the hopes of all who would stand against the enemy depend upon the success of his quest. And for this reason, it is best to say as little of it as possible. Those few of us who know of the Ring must guard this secret closely, and keep any hint of knowledge from reaching Sauron. There is wisdom in your words. There are too many unfriendly ears in the world, and we do not know where danger may be lurking. I must be on my way. Namarie. <laughs> 